you're very welcome back to the agromotive farm machinery youtube channel yeah just in this uh, in this video lads just a very uh, quick video on a line of um tooling a line of tools that are being distributed in the country by express bears in at Boyan county mead now express bears along with supplying uh, most of the motor, motor factors around the country with uh, clutches and dual mass flywheels and stuff like that they also do driveline products or drive train products uh, for changing gearbox oil, uh, stuff like that, and automatic transmission. So when your BMWs and your Mercs and stuff like that, um, they sell a line of products to, to deal with that. Uh, they also are the distributor in Ireland for Gidor tools, um, which are highly, uh, highly professional tools uh, made in Germany. Uh, a lot of their tooling will be used in as manufacturer-specific uh, special service tools, so for Volkswagen and the like, they, they use their tools for a lot of their special service tools. They are very high quality. Um, they're not your average tool that you'd be buying to service your car on a Saturday morning or whatever. But they do have a very specific line for agri, for plant, uh, the HGV end of things. And then they do the, uh, you know, the car end of things as well, the automotive and the high voltage uh, end of stuff as well. So yeah, um, Dara from uh, Extra Spares was kind enough to uh, invite me down to uh, meet the guys, to meet them and to meet the guys that were over from uh, Gidor themselves, just to have a chat with them about their, uh, their line of tooling, uh, just to go through the products and what they have uh, available on the Irish market. And yeah, it was very, very impressive as someone who's a qualified mechanic and has been for the last 25 odd years, um, I've always had had tools uh, in my hand, and still do. Uh, so yeah, I I appreciate I appreciate when you when you have quality, because I'll tell you when you're doing a job, whether it be out in the middle of a field or in a workshop, and something breaks or something you know slips, uh, rounds a nut or that one socket that you need to do that one particular job and it snaps. You know, and you have to drive 20 kilometers or something or to the nearest motor factors to try and get another one. It, it pays when you're a professional to go for the professional tools. They also do a line of tools to do very specific jobs like uh, wheel bearings, you know, pressing in and out wheel bearings, um, pulling off hubs that can be particular, uh, particularly stubborn, uh, fitting bushings into arms, you know, and then holding shock absorbers, stuff like that. They have, they have a full range of tools. Um, and I'm sure you can look them up on their, on their website. I'll, uh, I'll drop a link in here uh, in the comment section and you can, you can check them out. But yeah, I went down there at the National Plowing Championships. Uh, they were kind enough to invite me down. So we went down. Had a chat, uh, had a look at our tools, um, and yeah, this is how we got on. Okay, so just sit back and enjoy the video, guys. Any comments? Uh, and if you have any interest in any of these tools, if you'd like to hear more about them, um, don't be afraid to get in contact. Um, I can put you in contact uh, with, with, with the people in the know. Yeah, so yeah, thanks a million, and uh, yeah, enjoy the little video. Cheers. Robert from Guido. Um, so Guido Supply, to the Irish market, uh, special tools and equipment for the motor trade, the agri trade, and heavy goods. Yes. So, special tools, um, hand tools, high voltage equipment, uh, tools for high voltage for the safety end of things. Robert, if you just want to take us through your range, just you know what you're what you're focusing on, what you think might be the Irish uh, buyer might be interested in. Yeah, well, actually, for the first time in Ireland, and I've been doing this for ten years now. Uh, we actually brought our ATV special tools, which actually work in both ATV as Agri, because it's actually a multifunctional um, Duplo system with which you can build the, the cooler or the pushing kit that you need on the basis of hydraulics. So with ATV, we use a 28 ton cylinder, mm -hmm. which can push and pull in the, in the same sense. It has an internal thread. So you can make all sorts of adjustments. And this is actually a hub puller to pull the big hubs from 90 to 22 inches. But then in the center, there's actually the small hubs for the deep loaders, which goes from 10 to 17 inch. Okay. And then you can pull those off support, but with support of the, of the hydraulic cylinder. But with the hub puller, you can actually make a press frame as well. And then you have a stationary press 
with which you can do silent brushes and, mm -hmm. and, and joints, but you can also do kingpins. Okay. Yeah. So, and in order to pack it all neatly and nicely, we actually put everything in a trolley. So we have a selection of incredibly big spanners, which is the Excelsior's, and this is all hand forged. So there's a German doing every day doing this and this. Yeah. And then a, 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 a ten ton weight is actually pressing this to 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 fit the need Creator. of the yeah. user. So it's it's all German made. And I'm obviously not German. <laughs> uh, I'm Dutch. So what we try to do is we try to provide a, 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 a universal solution for the undercarriage. So that's ball joints, silent bushes, hubs, all the common problems one can encounter. And most of the times try to make solutions themselves. Yeah. But just if you're not exactly straight, if you're not on a 90 degree angle, yeah. you need two times the amount the pressure, of force. Yeah. yeah. So this trolley actually has three drawers filled. And then the entire lot, which is standing over here, actually is made to fit. Fit into that. Yeah. yeah. So you have a system, <clears throat> and that gives you the potential of actually going to the vehicle, select what you need. What you want. And we have experienced some quite interesting stuff with this. So this is all the HUV stuff, and of, of course we have spanners going up to 120 millimeters, mm -hmm. and we go down to four. Okay. So, and the same goes with torque wrenches. So our torque range is from 0 0.04 newton meters up to 54,000. So, and it's, we have a solution for every fit. Mm -hmm. So this one with the mushroom, you can actually turn around. So you can also use it for measuring how much force is needed in order to loosen something. Loosen in order to, to prevent it from breaking. This is quite common with glow plugs. Yep. So so that's the HCV bit. And we have many more to tell. We have a complete catalog yep. with all the HCV stuff, which is out there, torque multipliers, special sockets, special spanners, injector pulling stuff, engine reverse, oil. Uh, just request it and uh, we'll sort you out sort. with the information you potentially are looking yep. for. So one of the key factors we are showcasing on this exhibition is actually the, let me see, yeah, it works. It's actually an endoscope camera, which can swivel up to 180 degrees in order to look in down, down in an engine and just look at the top of the cylinder yeah, head, how it's doing. Yeah. It has a light with different intensities. Mm -hmm. You can also connect it to your phone, mm -hmm. so you can directly tell the customer what's actually going on. Yeah, you can record. You can record. You can record as yeah. yeah, yeah. You can take pictures, record, yeah. and connect your phone. Yeah, that's yeah. very handy, yeah. It's 3.9 millimeters mm -hmm. and has this rectangle. So far, this is the cable that comes with it. Yeah. So, yeah. So we do hand tools as well, mm -hmm. so we have, the problem is always what will you take? So we took the most extensive trolley that we have with eight drawers filled with all the tools that an automotive mechanic is looking need, for, yeah. nothing in excess, but this is all hand forged tools. So in order to lock it into place, but all eight drawers are filled and actually we have a little surprise in the third drawer because anybody everybody needs this <laughs> <I'm> brilliant <laughs> in order to sell the Irish toolbox exactly, that's how one of those. <laughs> exactly and this is also interesting because most of the times when we want to loosen something we take the torque wrench, torque wrench to break it and this is actually extendable breaker bar to prevent you from damaging your torque, torque wrench, wrench. Yeah. yeah and then obviously all the screwdrivers are in there as well. The files. And this is all handmade by G Door. A drill set, spanners, some more spanners with a ratchet. And very important because everybody says, Can I use impact on it? Mm -hmm. You can, but yeah. if you damage it, don't claim it for warranty. warranty. 
That's why we have the black ones. Yeah. This is impact. High impact. And we have it in all sorts as well. And everybody needs an empty drawer for, for bits and pieces. Rubbish. Yeah. <laughs> so that's hand tools. Fantastic. We do some wire harness wire repair cutting. kit. This is actually quite specific. Each and every one set of those pliers are 300 euros each. There's 11 in there and a complete kit with all the cable connectors yeah. in order to make an original With repair. Harness, yeah, yeah. Because that's one of our core competencies. We mm. try to provide OEM solutions according to the specifications of the manufacturer yeah. of the parts. Mm. So not necessarily the manufacturer of the vehicle or the brand, mm -hmm. but the manufacturer of the of parts. The parts. Yeah, be so it Hella or Bosch. Or, yeah. Exactly. Mm. Whether you're talking about wheel bearings, silent blocks or wire harness repair, this is OEM spec. spec. And of course, we do the FACRA system as well, which is signaling cable. Mm -hmm. So we're talking GPS, edge cameras, yeah. back and front, to do repairs, original repairs of the cable connection. The cables are in there, that's two different uh, diameters. And it's, it's, it's kind of the same repair as you do with the coaxial Co cable at yeah. home, uh, but then with much tinier parts and therefore we chose to include a different color of connectors yeah. male and female so that everybody can see okay it's an original repair but it has been repaired repaired yeah especially when navigations get stolen this is interesting enough yeah so and then we go to the automotive the 12 volt part this is actually a trolley we had many customers in asking for ball joint replacement Mercedes, ball joint replacement Volkswagen Movano and Renault Master, uh, wheel bearing replacement of Pro Ace and Citroen mm. Jumpy. The thing is, we start looking for one solution for one problem. The problem is you spend a lot of money on having just that solution. Mm. So at a certain point in time, like 10 years ago, we decided let's turn that around. So we actually made a trolley, which is 14,000 euros. And I say this with pride mm -hmm. because if you break it down and you do 10 stock drive shafts, 10 hubs, mm -hmm. 10 bearings, mm -hmm. 10 silent blocks and 10 ball joints each year. So mm -hmm. that's one a week. And you do that for five consecutive years in a yeah. row. Then you break the 14,000 euros down because that's actually what the accountant says you need to write it off in yes. and the tax office. Yes. And we don't like those fuckers. But it actually helps us making the calculation, what is my actual cost price of this? It's 56 euros each job. Mm. And when replacing a bearing, a bearing on the car, yeah. like a BMW rear wheel bearing, mm. you can do it with this kid in one hour if yeah. you're an experienced mechanic. Yeah. But it doesn't start with the wheel bearing. It starts with the drive shaft. Yeah. And then the hub. And then the barrier. The brakes, yeah. So that's three jobs actually. So how you make that calculation count for yourself, if you invest in a tool like this, in a solution like this, and you can cover 90% of mm. all jobs, and you understand that it's like a Lego kit, yep. where you build a solution at hand on the car, so you don't need to dismantle ABS, you don't need to dismantle brake lines. So that saves you a, a significant amount of time. time yeah. And we do trainings with it as well, mm -hmm. because this is not somebody takes your blue eyes on it. Okay, yeah. let, let's do it. <laughs> no, we showcase it. And David's doing that from drivetrain. He's traveling in a van all across Ireland doing demonstrations. But according to the quid pro quo principle, listen, we come out, we help you out. But please bear in mind, we have a business to run as yeah, well. As well. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, that's fantastic because it's all about efficiency these days. Time is money. Time <laughs> is the only thing we can't get yeah, back. Can't get back. Exactly. So if I spend four hours on on on, on a job that doesn't yeah. go according to standards, and yeah. I can only charge two, when I, whereas I invest in this tool, mm -hmm. and I can do the job and you need to learn it yeah. eh? you need to invest some time to get in to get to know how to use the system to get the yeah. hang of it yeah. but if you can do it in the same amount of time, time. In two hours yeah then you actually don't lose yeah well i've seen in my experience i've seen lads going on wheel bearings with hammers with gas torches with pry bars induction broken abs sensors you know broken fondant wheels 
and not only did they lose time, they broke other parts in the, you know, in the process. Exactly. And that, all, that all adds up. I know it sounds like a lot of money off the bat, but when you put it over three or five years and you break it down to each job that you're doing, it makes sense. It makes perfect sense. I actually use this kind of calculation to scare away the ones who don't understand the basic economics of doing business. Because we also have a trolley which is eight. Mm -hmm. But with 14, you get 92% coverage. Yeah. And with eight, you get 65% coverage. Yeah. And this is also a question customers ask. Am I fully sorted then? It's easier for me to explain what you can't do with it than what you can it's do with it. It's a smaller list, yeah. Because it's an incredible piece of kit where the basic hydraulic mm. is operated wheel bearings, generation one, two, and three. And yeah, it, this is a lot of kits, but you have to look at it like the stationary press where there's a separate box next to it yeah. with all the old bearings, different diameters, but we don't just, just do the bearings. We also do the centering. The centering, yeah. In order to get it, to guide it Perfect in, then center, straight, center yeah. it in. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, wheel bearing and drive shafts, by the way, and generation three. And then this is luxury. Mm -hmm. So this is for inner race bearing, ball joint ball dismantling, yeah. locking the hub. And this is all operating tools for drive. And then ball joints. Ball joints, yeah. And bushings, bushings yeah. and also the Ford Volvo bushings in the back yeah but also and the small ones yeah. for the V40 and uh, V50 and S40 and Mazda 3 and 5 have them in the rear that's as right, well yeah. but that's not all ball joints transport the T4 the top one, top one. Oh, can cause havoc yeah. but it's it's included in this kit as well okay and I'm not saying that you can get every rusty bolt out mm. like clockwork yeah. no but once you've got the room to mount this kid, you're in for 10 to 20 minutes and then you're done. Okay. The only thing you need to do is apply RTFM. Yes. And you know what RTFM is. Hi. You're going to tell us. RTFM stands for read the fucking manual. manual. <laughs> Please. Yeah. And there's actually no reading involved because we work with pictures. Yeah. Just follow the steps Just in around the pictures. Self -explanatory, We're yeah. all visionary people. Yeah. We need to see and then our hands yeah. can do it. So if I look at the pictures, okay, this is how they say I should do it. Make it so that it seems yeah, to fit fits, that yeah. picture. So this kit you're saying does up to what? 92%. Yeah. But as regards for, for people, would it do Land Cruisers? Yeah. Yeah, Transits? Yeah. Transit, no. 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 There is an additional kit for transit, mm. so it's in the 8%. Yes. The funny thing is, if you have this kit and you want to do a transit, mm. you can actually get it out within 10 minutes, not including the, those darn Torx 50 Just bolts. Straight through the hub, yeah. Those, yeah. those, <laughs> those <laughs> bolts can cause havoc have as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But once you got those out, we yeah. actually have five pins. Yes. We support, and we actually take the bearing out Ooh. without damaging it. Mm. So you can also, with the same kit, push off the brake disc yes so you don't damage the bearing you need to clean it though because mm -hmm. it rusts and ford actually says replace the bearing as well as well the thing is this system is operated with a 17 ton hydraulic cylinder. cylinder yeah that might be might not be sufficient to actually push the bearing off the hub mm -hmm. but the kit works independently once you get it out of the car yeah. you can move it anywhere and you need to go and look if the 17 ton doesn't cut the job mm -hmm. you need to go look for a 40 ton press so that's practicality yes, for you yes. but the kit for transit the additional kit is 280 quid oh, yes, you can make it back on one car yeah but if you're buying this you know with the extra 280 euro you know for the amount of transit that's on the road it depends on whether the customer even does transit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and that's wouldn't. why we don't include it yeah, because okay. there's no end to it. That's the problem. Yes, In order, yes, yes. The, the golden rule is I spend 20% of my money getting 80% of the solutions. Yes. But in order to get the rest of the 20%, I need to spend 80% 80%, of yeah. my money. The 28 euro goes for a lot of things in life. Yeah. And I try to make it as honest as possible, but also with the experience of 10 years in the job, mm. actually performing demonstrations every week. And the responses of the mechanics yes. actually being present, that's what drives yeah. me. Yeah.
So for me, it's not about sales. That's up to the guys of Express Pairs. Yeah. They do a grand job at it. Yeah. We want to prove, make your life easier. easier. Yeah. yeah. And ultimately more profitable. Yeah. So one of our best-selling machines actually turned. It's it's already in existence for over ten years. Mm. It's the spring compressor. Yeah. And there's been lots and lots of told on it already. We've done videos. We've done showcasing. Mm -hmm. The problem is, if you look at it from a two-dimensional point of view, you don't get it. Mm -hmm because we need 3D in order to determine, wait a minute, this is something completely different. different yeah. yeah. So what I can explain is, since last year, Volkswagen had a pro problem with their ID bus. Okay. And they decided they need a solution for that. And once again, we presented them with this solution. This is now an original VAS machine yeah. because of the ID bus. And we're now telling every Volkswagen dealer that it's actually a universal, yeah, machine, universal machine, which fits all of okay. their struts. Yeah. We haven't found the strut for this machine that doesn't fit. Doesn't fit. Whether it's a Chrysler, mm. a Toyota, a Hyundai, a transporter, mm. it fits all and some of them are actually ridiculously easy to fix. Mm. Like a Mercedes ML. Yeah. The back one. Yes. The very long where you yeah. can't you stick can't anything in between. In. Yeah, yeah. It's four minutes job with this with machine. That machine. Yeah. yeah. And We'll tell you all about it once you are seriously interested. Mm. Obviously, it's not a cheap machine either, mm. but it's a solution. Yes. And that's what we like to tell. So there's loads and loads more to tell yeah. on injector pulling, glow plug removal, which is actually my hobby. Um. I've done over a thousand, so I can say I'm a somewhat of a, yeah. a grown yeah, into, expert. I wouldn't say expert, that's up to others to decide but I do have some experience with it. And I try to provide a simplified way of explaining, listen, the 80% of the injector yeah, problems yeah. you have, we can cover for under 500 euros. But the moment you start talking about the problem engines, like the two liter DCI, mm, the two the and a half, the, yeah. the three liter ATIs, then yes, money starts adding up, mm -hmm. but if you have a universal solution, which you can go multiple mm. ways with, so also Mercedes V6 is yeah. in the in the engine yeah. bay. The same solution is actually included in this, in in our um, offering. Yeah. It's too much to actually handle, but it's beautiful to see the responses <laughs> of the mechanics once you're in. And yeah. we did it with GTD diesels. Oh yeah. They struggled for three days on an injector, and I wasn't even there to showcase mm. this. We got it out in 10 minutes. Wow. And the mechanic was looking like this when we entered, because you have another sales guy in. Yeah, yeah. And then we started explaining the spring compressor, which yeah. they bought in the Automechanica in Frankfurt. I started explaining it, and then we got to talk about this. He told us it took us three days, and we, 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 we don't want to damage anything, but then you're in problem. Mm -hmm. We built the kit up, used his own hydraulics because he already had hydraulics, and within 10 minutes it was out. It was and that caused them to smile. And the mechanic who looked like this, <laughs> he was actually, we made his day. Very good. And we all recognized that once a job is done, done. Yeah. and you're happy. Yeah. Then you can go. Yeah, home yeah, and yeah. And otherwise, we lie awake, contemplating on thinking. What am I going to tell the customer? How? <laughs> That's also something. Yeah. Now is the time to make money with repairs, mm. because the advice is keep your vehicles moving. Moving, yeah. And the, that starts with us getting, giving good advice to the customer. You need to sort this out. You need to sort that out. Yeah. And unfortunately, yes, there is an investment mm -hmm. which comes with it. It is what it is. Um, yeah, very good. That's excellent. Um, there's nothing else you want to cover, is there? At this point in time, I'll no, say I think we've done enough. We, we